What's up, guys? No, no, here. <laughs> and I'm back with another video. Um, so today we're going to be doing some B-Mensch Drive. I'm sorry I haven't done die up or Slither in, like, forever. Um, I did do a video on that, and uh, it didn't save, so the video I did with Eric sort of filled up that slot. Anyway, so today I'm going to be doing some awesome AI stuff. And also, I did change the license plate. I know I said I'd do that, and I did. So now it's the great. Wait, before we over it. I'll stutter. Come on. Oh, um, something I noticed. For some reason, the camera adjusting keys haven't been working. Whoa. Okay, the camera adjusting keys are moving vehicle instead of... What? Okay, this is weird. I'll be right back. I have no idea what to do. <laughs> I can't figure out how to make the camera move. I looked in the controls, and suddenly the camera... Uh, I, I, I don't understand. Create a new binding, maybe? Uh, warning. I, I don't even want to... Uh, well, that makes me sad. I, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, so... <clears throat> so, uh, some of the AI thing is cut off from the video recording. You can see my mouse going in and out. And that's just uh, debug, engine debug, whatever. Um, and it's cut off because I can't record this in full screen because of my recorder. <laughs> anyway, so this is pretty cool. So you can set it to random and it'll follow the AI you see in the mini map, which there isn't one. So it's not going to do anything. So what I can do is set it to flee, which isn't currently on camera. So I'm going to have to go full screen real quick. Just alt enter for me. Okay. And uh, set it to flee. And then I'm going to open up another vehicle. Okay, and I'm just going to pick the uh, same one. And then uh, spawn new. And then set it to chase. Oops, this guy decided to set it to. physics. Oops. That's kind of loud. All right, let's go back to, hopefully you guys can see this. <laughs> um, come on. Uh, okay then, unfreeze physics. So see one, this guy's gonna, this guy's supposed to be set to chase. <laughs> right. Spawn them both. So this guy's gonna want to run away and this guy is just failing. All right, never mind. So it's kind of fun, and I'm not touching any controls. So, um, what I can do is tap with the accelerator. So I can just tap that, and now it's suddenly going down. I can hold it, and then switch to the other one. Now they're both going to be going full speed. Now watch this. Alright, now I want to show you something cool. I call this the bull thingy. You can still hear in the background. So this is in the new update. I have no idea why it just says template preview replace this. I don't know if I'm supposed to add a picture or something or if they're going to get rid of that map eventually, but it just appeared there in the new update, so might as well do it. So what I'm going to do here is get a normal, normal off-road truck in red. And I can't do it, so let's do this. Hopefully that'll work. And it's gray. Well, that's just gray. Sorry. <laughs> and I'll go ahead and uh, change the color. Also, I noticed a little menu, the circle menu that comes up up here when I press escape. It disappeared, so I don't know if I messed something up real bad, but oh well. So if I change this, it's going to like that. Was that? Okay, that's the color. Good. So I'm just going to... Why is... Why are you doing this? Or just red. I don't know why... It, okay. It's because i got to go full screen, so, you know, and then I don't want to do that so you guys can't see. So now I'm going to uh, pull up a extended cab one. Uh, and it's going to be in brown. I just, I just do, do that. I... Dang it, it's in yellow. Oh, I forgot to hit spawn new, too. Alright, I'll be right back. i got to get full screen. Okay, we're back. And, um... So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to control one of them, set this guy to chase, and this guy is going to be under my control. You are now under my control. Your mind is mine. 
and said, and sounds like my mom's making a smoothie. <laughs> so I'm just gonna have to talk really quiet and into this. So sadly, I can't. Excuse me. <laughs> I can't change my camera. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Thanks. I could just go like this. <laughs> I don't know why it's not working. I could try resetting the camera quick. This doesn't work. So you can see that guy down there is trying real hard to get to me. So you can do fun stuff on this. Really, he missed. Anyway, I'm going to reset this and hope that the game works this time. And uh, after my mom's done blending, I'll be right back. Alright guys, I have no idea what's going on. I'm really sorry. But I did finally learn what vehicle recovery button is. So I'll show you in just a second what that even means. Dang it, I wish it would just... See, look, that's me using the things that usually I do for the camera. I can't zoom in or out. That makes me really angry. And then I looked in the control, it says camera to two options, so I have no idea for the numpad, and I don't, I don't know what to do. So anyway, this is what vehicle recovery does, I'll show you. I just, dang it, I'm really such a good driver. Really? That's, that's what... Like, seriously? Alright, so, let's, uh, try to do something more, let's try to do something more dangerous, like just climb up the mountain and launch myself. Here we go. Just like, here. No damage whatsoever. A goal figure. Come on. Try to damage it for crying out loud. <laughs> we can get over here. There we go. There's some damage. Come on, are you... if it just slides down without getting any more damage, I will like scream. What? Okay, apparently zero is um, vehicle recovery. <laughs> so is insert. Well, anyway, so that's what vehicle recovery does. <laughs> it, uh, well, recovers your vehicle. I can try to do a crash up here, just to go, like, it could help if I could go faster and I knew how in the world to change the camera. Maybe I should just get a faster car. Come on. Seriously. I'll be right back once I crash. So, um, I did crash. <laughs> and now thanks to vehicle recovery, you can see exactly where I went when I crashed the vehicle. <laughs> I may or may not have gone everywhere. <laughs> so yeah, anyway, get a little sidetracked. I'll be right back on a different map. Alright, and I'm back at the other map. Somehow it glitched out, but... Anyway, I'll show you what I did. So what I did is, I took a sport... Which is a little bit us, uh, really, a little bit slower than the custom. And right now I gotta set one to flee because it likes to glitch out. <laughs> Alright, so I set the sport one, or the, the custom one to flee because it, again it's faster. And I'm not messing with any of them, other than the camera angle. And I just and flee is fleeing while still falling. AI, if you see in the bottom left. I could set it to random too, and I won't go to flee. And then they always decide to crash. I don't know why. Or, like right there, they decide to crash. They're like, woohoo! And this is a really good smoothie. <laughs> so you can see that guy's falling behind a little bit. And this guy's fleeing. What I can do is set the drawing distance to like 200 meters. I don't really know what the difference is. I think it's like how far it plans ahead, which obviously wasn't enough. <laughs> anyway, so that's uh, that. I need to know how much time I have left. Alright, uh, so I got like five minutes with you guys. I'm like two thirds of the way through, so I'm gonna do this one more time, but with different vehicles. I don't know why this one decided to be flea, but I'll be right back. 
Oops. That's not very bad. Alright, so now we got two Ibishu Pigeons, 600M, one set to flee and one set to chase. Right now the chase one doesn't know what he's doing to play. I set the drawing distance to 10 kilometers, just to see if that helps him plan out better. So this guy's drawing distance to 50. Maybe it's the distance that they're allowing between them. See, it actually made the corner, it usually doesn't do that, even with the pigeons. I'm just gonna let this play out. Oh, uh, that guy tilts it on two wheels. <laughs> he made an oopsie. I wish I could change the camera because I don't know why I can't. What you should do is just set one to full throttle. That'd be funny. Oh, I should probably tell you guys how to get the AI. So, it's not a mod. What you gotta do is you go into options. You're going to go to gameplay, and you're going to make sure that there's a check mark in Enable Advanced Functions. And then you're going to go to Apps, and then you're going to Add, and you're going to scroll down until you find AI somewhere in there, AI Control. And then uh, when you're done, you just drag it to wherever you want it. And that dude has decided to turn around, and I don't know why the other guy decided he doesn't want to chase him anymore. What? Excuse me? Can I move him? Move you. Move you back here. And, uh, you on the two wheels. This dude's just done for it. And this dude's like, bye bye. He's like, bye for you too. I don't know what this dude's problem is. <coughs> this guy's like freedom or fish do. <laughs> now there are some things in the AI I don't understand or don't know. There's disabled, random, manual, chase, flee, and stopping. Obviously those aren't on camera right now. Um, and I don't know I don't know what I mean, disable is obviously disabled, but sometimes it'll switch to stopping, so I don't know if I don't understand. So, if I were to take this guy and go... What would happen? <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just funny to watch. There we go. Made it over. I didn't actually drag him. So this dude needs to get with it. That works. Can he still drive? He can still drive. Okay. Come on, give me crypto. <laughs> Alright, so I got about a minute left, guys, and I'm just gonna let this play out. And this is sort of a, I don't know, it felt like a reasonably short video, but it's normal time as always, so. Remember to uh, leave a like if you enjoyed watching this video. Uh, let me know that I'm doing all good. Let me feel the love. And um, if you want to see more like it, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Or do lots of videos like this. And, uh, well, uh, tell me in the comments if you want to see other videos that I haven't been doing. <laughs> and uh, as always, guys, see you on the flip side. We have a winner!